Hi everyone, my name is Sarah Wildner and I'm a product manager for the Monitor Stage. 2020 will be the year we see enormous growth in the operations section, which comprises the configure and monitor stages. For context, we own Kubernetes configuration management and monitoring, as well as application performance monitoring and incident management. The operations space is already occupied by a number of strong players. Chef, Red Hat, Datadog, Splunk, just to name a few. This means we need to be tar targeted in our investment so that we can meet the demands of the ever-evolving market. I want to make clear that this investment is small and strategic. We're starting now so that in a year, when you encounter a prospect that says, GitLab, we are all in on Cloud Native. We already have an operations platform for you to sell. We are well positioned to take advantage of a few key opportunities. And full ownership DevOps teams, developers are king. They have more say than ever before in the tooling they use to build technology. However, some DevOps transformations are hindered by a lack of IT operation skills within those development teams. They want to close the gap. Their culture is ready to shift, but not enough team members possess the skills to run and maintain the services they are responsible for. To ease this pain, we are focusing our tools on enabling developers to complete operational tasks alongside writing code. There is a clear winner in cloud native as an architecture that speeds up cycle time and organizations are flocking to Kubernetes as a result, a tool we invested in ahead of the game. Our source code management and continuous integration tools are well used and loved in market and they form the foundation upon which we will expand into infrastructure and observability as code. So where is the market today? Organizations are seeking tools that help them to simplify their DevOps transformations and to help their DevOps teams get up off the ground. GitLab is ahead of the market, and we can see that in our CI pipelines, which are well used and loved. The market is evolving, however, and we've been anticipating what comes next. As companies become more comfortable with shipping faster and faster, new concerns will pop up, which will change their demands and the needs they have of their IT tool chains. Once they've mastered CI, they'll be looking to close the loop with DevSecOps. Soon thereafter, it will be commonplace to manage infrastructure as code. When a majority of our customers start asking us about containerizing legacy applications and moving to the cloud to increase operational efficiencies, the market will have reached cloud native. That is where GitLab will shine as an operations platform. We aren't there now, but we will be ready to meet the market when it arrives. Our 2020 mission is to drive cloud native adoption via tools that make it easy for developers to wear the hat of an operations or a DevOps engineer. We are building an operations platform in GitLab to accelerate the DevOps transformations of our customers. Today, organizations of all types are using GitLab to manage their infrastructure as code. This year, we are excited to work with Terraform to provide a fully integrated experience. We will also be investing heavily in incident management in GitLab. Imagine if there was just one tool that an engineer on call had to investigate during an outage. Starting with the incident, they could easily navigate into metrics, logs, traces, and errors from the applications they maintain, drastically reducing time to determine the root cause. Incident management is key to closing the DevOps loop. Teams rooted in DevOps who are focused on shipping fast will also need a way to efficiently feed system and application improvements back into the plan stage. In operations, we are laser focused on streamlining this experience to make it simple for those writing and running the code to also contribute to the design and resilience of the product itself. 